What's up everyone, welcome back to the Durbin Compound. If you haven't met me already, my name is Devin Durbin. So today on the channel we are doing another sock review, uh, the copper merino wool socks from Duluth Trading Company. So um, I'm a little biased towards Duluth Trading Company, but uh, I will not let that affect my review. The review is good, so if you're looking at these socks, um, don't hesitate to buy them. But uh, let's get into the real reason why we're here. Uh, we'll break it down a little bit, and um, yeah, we'll talk more about them right after this. All right, so now we can get down to the real reason why we're here. Let's talk a little bit more in depth about these uh, merino wool socks. So keep in mind that uh, around this uh, part of the season, uh, we're in fall now. I think we just hit the first day of fall a couple days ago. Um, so it has been rather hot. Um, there's been a couple cool mornings I've had these on. Um, they're fantastic. Um, and, and the true test is just how, how well they wick um, during some of their hotter climates, um, working on them and just overall the comfort of the sock. Now, these socks on the website right now are at $13.27. Um, they're on sale right now, but they're usually 19 bucks. So they are a cheaper option than those darn tufts that we had uh, looked at before. A little bit more expensive than the wigwams, I think. Uh, so uh, when it comes down to merino wool socks, um, they're right on par with the rest of everybody else. So uh, the I know we were doing this before and talking about percentages and everything. These are 48% nylon, 25% merino wool, 25% uh, acrylic, and 2% spandex. So a little bit more spandex than any other um, sock that I had tried. And they're right there around the 25% uh, merino wool content. So uh, those darn tufts, I think we're at 48%. Um, I cannot really tell a difference between these and darn tufts. I think they're both awesome socks. Um, everybody has this weird, I, when you're talking about merino wool socks or hiking socks or work socks, it, they come with crazy patterns and stuff like that. Um, I know that you really don't see your socks when you're working. Um, and maybe, be, maybe this is the actual merino wool here that's in a different color. I'm not sure. I'm not educated that much on them. So uh, if, if an expert is out there, a sock expert is out there um, and wants to weigh in in the comments, put it below. Uh, let us know if this area here is actually the merino wool and uh, the upper part is, you know, the, the nylon. Um, just let us know in the comments. That'd be really cool. Um, somebody help them out, uh, help us out. So these socks are really awesome. Um, I've worn these quite a few times now, um, and yeah, they're they're basically right on par with the darn tough. Uh, which one would I buy? Uh, I would probably buy the darn toughs over these uh, because these are a little bit harder to get on. So we're talking about really, you know, come down to apples to apples. Uh, these are just a little bit more spandex or a little tighter on your foot. They kind of feel like a compression sock. So these are a little tougher to get on your feet, but nonetheless, I mean, th those darn tufts are a little easier to slip on. You're going to have to work these up on your feet um, to get them, uh, you know, up into position. But overall, great sock. Um, I'm seeing a little bit of stitching come loose up here, uh, as you if you can see me pulling out the, pulling out the thread there. Um, I'm going to have to snip that back. Uh, they've been through a, a couple loads in the uh, washing machine and they look pretty darn good. So I just wanted to give you guys a quick down and dirty review of these socks. Um, if you're looking at them, if you're in the store and you're trying to think about it, um, this video is right for you because it's nice, sweet and short. And um, yeah, I totally recommend them. I definitely would spend more money in these socks. So I will continue my search and uh, just overall generally testing socks, giving you guys an honest opinion of how they feel in my boots. Um, these don't add a lot of, of padding to your foot. So uh, they, they do feel thick, but they're not like a traditional wool sock that, you know, it's like wearing 30 pairs of regular crew socks on top of each other. Um, these are really good and um, I really like them. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'd love to see you click subscribe. If you haven't subscribed already, definitely hit that, uh, smash that subscribe button and uh, give me a thumbs up or a thumbs down, whatever you're into. Uh, I think I'm going to start coming out with videos every Saturday and Saturdays only. I'm going to let my videos breathe a little bit. Um, 
heck, you might see me change my mind tomorrow and I'll be back to posting three videos a week. But um, nonetheless, if you've been around the channel, thanks for sticking around and we'll see you guys in the next video.